This is Lee Rosenbaum, and we are at the new Cooper Hewitt. Finally, we opened after years of retrofitting and uh, reconfiguring and renovating. And uh, one of the first things you encounter after the Dilla Scafidio and Renfro uh, introductory table, where people get their tickets and so on, is this interactive table. And here with me is Tim, who is one of the specialists <laughs> for the interactive table, who's gonna show us how it's done. So exactly. uh, how does this thing work? So there's two basic modes. You can either find an object from the permanent collection and learn more about it. Okay. And you can also design your own uh, object. Okay, and we have a little guy here who's already, who's already figured <laughs> he's it already out. designing. Let's see what he's doing here. He seems to know what to do intuitively, which for someone like me might not be as obvious. <laughs> Okay. Anyway, let's, let's see what you're going to show me. <laughs> so we have it on chair here. Okay. And we just draw here, yeah. and it'll come yes. up as a chair. What? Oh, look what you did! Look. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So we have a chair, and then you can also make it into something else. I think you said. If you... Yep. We can make it into a building. All right. <laughs> <laughs> or a hat. Have it fit. We can change the uh, material. Cool. And it's all meant to be very interactive and playful. Okay. And reflect the uh, the process of design. Okay. And we can also pick objects from. Is, are these collection objects that we? Yeah. These are around? all permanent collection objects. Yep. And we can find out more information about them. Okay. And one thing you don't have, I believe, is an audio guide, right? People aren't going around with audio guides in this. And you will have, eventually, the interactive pen. The pen, where you can save your experience with these, this symbol here. You'll be able to click it and save, uh -huh. save your designs and save uh, the uh, objects in the museum. Okay. And then you, you save it by uploading it to your device? Or how does, how does it... It's emailed to you. It's emailed, okay. Yep. And then you and then you have it on, on, have, on yeah, your computer exactly. or, or your tablet or whatever. Right. Yep. Okay. So this has basically two functions. One is to tell us about objects and the other in the collection, and the other is to to create your own object. Create yeah. your own. Exactly. And clearly, <laughs> for the younger set, this has a it's lot of allure <laughs> that we can see. 